It's my birthday, it's my birthday, I'm gonna spend my money. Most probably I won't be really spending money this time. <laughs> Hello, team Pumal. So today I thought about sitting down, talking to you guys about my birthday, how life is going in general, and things I'm excited about because I haven't done this sort of a talking video in a while, I think. Yeah. You know, a lot of people love to do things on their birthdays, different things. Some people go for halls, some people spend like crazy amounts of money on one thing. Some me, Last year, my sister threw me a pretty epic celebration. She, she gave me a surprise. She called all my friends. I had no idea. I came back home. I was out with some of my friends and I came back. I had no idea what was happening. And then I come back home and all of my friends are there. It was pretty good. I have to hand it over. It was very nice. It was really nice. So my birthday is on the 10th of April, which is this Sunday. Bye. I wanted to get this one thing done and I wanted to get it done for a while now. My, I thought my birthday is coming up and one of my best friends is getting married so her marriage is on the 20th. So I thought you know what, this would be the best time to get gel nails because it look fancy and I want it to look fancy so let us get started. Also I want to record the video of them doing it so I can show it to you guys because I know a lot of you also will be interested in getting gel nails done. And I knew a lot of salons have this thing, they don't want you to record anything that they're doing. I don't know why, but they do. So I thought, why not call Alaya? Alaya is the Spalon. Um, they're the ones that did my hair, if you guys remember. So I just called them up and I asked them if they have gel nails. And surprisingly, they did. They just started like two months ago. I recorded the whole thing for you guys to see. So, so now you're going to see how I got my gel nails. Hey guys, so now I'm at the Alaya Salon and I'm gonna start getting my nails done. And um, I'll try to record whatever that she's doing. And yeah. So, Sakshi's gonna be doing my nails today. Right? Hi. Hi. <laughs> so, you have all these pretty designs and all. I'm actually gonna decide which one I want. So my nails are now pretty much done. This is what it looks like. It's pretty long for me, but I'm going to try something new. And Sakshi has just given me this thing. It has all the colors. So I've chosen this one. Focus. This one. But I'm going to make it matte. And yeah. I really want to get the purple one, guys. Hey guys, so I just got my nails done. This is what it looks like, so cute. And now I'm gonna go to so the Alas Pan Salon. They have their own cafe now on the side, which is really cool. So the person that owns that, he asked us to come in and see how it is. It's really cute. You guys wanna see? Look, it has a very nice 
chilled out vibe. I'll take you inside. Come. Shreya. <laughs> really nice. Back and we have our food. It looks so good. You guys, you need to see this pizza. Okay, I think this is like the most beautiful pizza ever. <laughs> see, she has doing her wiseness. Hello. <laughs> Look how pretty. I know I shouldn't get freaked out about how pretty a pizza looks. Pasta. But this looks like Shutterstock. Perfect pizza yeah. picture. <laughs> yeah, this is what my gel nails look like now. They're pretty. So I got all of the fingers, apart from these ones, have golden glitter, uh, which is mattified. So it has a matte coat, top, top coat. Top coat is matte. And these ones. This feels so dirty. These ones um, are still glossy and they have these rhinestones on top. So it's really cute. The shape of it is square and I like it. Although it's a little uncomfortable right now because I'm not used to it. But I think I will get used to it. And it doesn't really feel anything to be very honest. Um, they're not sharp at all. So even if I'm scratching my face or anything, it's not coming off. It's not like doing anything I scratched my hand every place has been scratched already because that's what happens in summertime in summertime you scratch yourself because you feel hard and you want to murder yourself the only thing that I've noticed is I'm washing my hands way more than I should because I just feel like there's gonna be bacteria <laughs> in my hand it costs about 1500 plus taxes uh, to get these gel nails done and it took around an hour and I really like it I, I won't lie I think the next if I do get it done will be like those pointy ones I think those are really interesting it just feels like normal nails it doesn't really it's not leaving any mark it's pretty solid it just my fingertips hurt a bit because whatever I'm using you know like the nails go first and then my finger touches it so I guess it's something that is an acquired talent <laughs> also like holding on to your phone is really fun let me show you so you know how you usually use your phone you just go like tap, 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 tap. I can't do that anymore I have to kind of position my fingers in this way and also the my best friend right now is that thing where you can slide your finger and then it just types for you that's again a good thing also typing like this is becoming a very big problem um, if you're the sort of person that pulls your jeans up a lot I, I do that a lot I, I don't wear belts or anything I wear jeggings most of the time this might be a little bit of a problem initially I will keep you guys updated about my nails and if you have any other questions about any of these please leave it in the comments box below and I'll try to leave the details of the Spalon Alaya Spalon in the description box as well i'm very excited for my birthday and i'm very very excited for you guys to see the secret project videos by the way there's not just one video huh? there's going to be like more videos of the secret project and i'm just so excited oh my god oh by the way we just crossed 37,000 sundaris so i'm really happy because i love it when new people come in and they start seeing my videos and then I have all these comments by new Sundaris, new team Komal Sundaris and it's just really nice because people ask me questions and it's just a very holistic interaction. Does that make sense? I don't think it makes sense. I don't really see my success as like numbers to be very honest because I know that you guys I know that you guys take what I say seriously and that is what genuinely matters to me to be very honest because you can have like 2 million followers but if people don't listen to you and if people don't believe you it doesn't matter because it's just not good enough I'm really happy because all of you guys actually listen to me actually care about what I say rather than just like yeah whatever and you know, I love to get all the comments that you guys give me, even the 
critiquing comments are fine unless they're trolling comments trolling comments are just so stupid sometimes i really appreciate each and every comment of you guys i try to reply to all the comments that i possibly can <coughs> and sometimes it gets crazy because i travel and i work quite a bit but whenever i get the time i try to i hope you guys feel as happy as i do when you see me making more videos and doing better at what i was not doing better before and yeah i'm just really happy and on this birthday i guess all i want is for you guys to tell me how i can be better you know how i can be a better person how i can create better content and just stuff so if you guys have any birthday wishes for me please leave those also in the comments box below it's really cute for me to read sometimes they make my day and yeah i hope you guys like this video and that's it